Sandra Douglas Morgan, the new leader of the Las Vegas Raiders, the first black woman ever to become president of any NFL team. But she's been breaking barriers in a male dominated field long before this position. I sat down with her as she shared her driving force and plans for the season. It's been um, a really surreal first month. A whirlwind of activity for Sandra Douglas Morgan as the new president of the Las Vegas Raiders. This week, kicking off a partnership with Viva Airbus and the excitement of the first preseason game at home this Sunday. You come at a time when there's been a lot of a lot of change in the front office, and you've taken on a lot. Um, what is your message to fans, employees, and players about how you're going to run the office? Well, the, the most important, obviously, thing to all Raiders is always going to be fans and our Raider Nation. But we have to make sure that our employees understand that every single thing that we do is for that shield and for um, the Raiders and just the legacy and the rich history that it holds. She says she wants to wipe the slate clean, focus on a fresh new future, hold employees accountable, and lead by example, which this trailblazer is accustomed to doing, becoming the first black city attorney in our state. She served on the Nevada State Athletic Commission and was appointed the first chairwoman of the Nevada Gaming Control board. I mean, you have broken down barriers. Gaming industry, the sports world, male dominated. It's incredible, Sandra. Walking in that room and seeing that no one else kind of in there looks like you and not letting that hold you back and just believing in yourself. Sandra credits her work ethic to her parents who instilled a commitment to hard work, education, values of excellence. Principal Sandra says align well with the Raiders organization. I am just so truly happy to be a part of such a historic organization that has always prided itself on its values, its commitment to excellence, its commitment to diversity um, and equity and inclusion. And now that I'm in this position and knowing that I have Mark's support to encourage those principles, you know, not only throughout the Raiders, but throughout the NFL, it just really makes, you know, all of, I think, the work that, that I've done over the few, over the last, you know, decades uh, much, much more sweeter. And Sandra says her family, husband, and two kids mean everything to her in addition to her parents who still live here, and they all help keep her grounded.